We were talking about their doors, um, about a particular game that Fabregas played in against Spurs, if I can remember rightly. And I don't know if you played in it. Adebayor scored that absolutely rocket at White Hart Lane. I think you may have been marking him. Benny, why have you brought this up? <laughs> you know damn well I played in it. I was, play? I was marking Adi as he oh, I don't remember scored. this game. Yeah, Talk me through it. Talk me through the goal. It was an incredible goal. It was... To be fair, we had some hard games against Arsenal. It was... At, the, at that period, Arsenal were far superior to us. Cesc was running things. <laughs> Adi was like... Adebayor would score nigh on every game. It, it was hard. Massive rivalry, North London derbies. And you you go going into these games look the gaps and the tables turned towards the end of my, my time there and Spurs then uh, went above but at that time when Addy yeah he flicked one up and he hit this he hit this volley <laughs> and just see the back of my shirt it was just incredible great finish and Addy was a handful Addy was one of the best players on his day to play against he was six foot three he could leap he was could run channels he was unbelievable, um, and then thankfully when we we did sign him, we saw we we saw a few glimpses of the magic that we saw as uh, as he had at the Emirates. You know, the only thing I say about that goal is obviously as a defender, you don't turn your back from the audio. <laughs> no, no, I'm, no, I'm asking a question. Is is that like a cardinal sin to turn your back when someone hits a shot? I tried to get no, my no, right foot. Ben, I didn't turn me back on it, Ben. Yeah, he, he flicked it up, and I tried. He was just a bit quicker than me. And he just followed it on the on the side, volley no, into the. But I can see the number on the back of your shirt. Oh, Ben, to give it a rest. You know, <laughs> just you. You have to reminisce about this, just because you never got a kick against me. <laughs> Do you remember the goal, does it? He's talking about. Adam I Hill. don't actually, but um, uh, there was a story that we said on air. I think you remembered on, uh, off air. Sorry, that when you two played against each other. Yeah, Benton never fancied it, and it all came. No, no. It all came to a time, Daz, when we played. He was at Charlton at the time, and and to be fair, myself and Benty, I I, I actually like Benty. He's a great, great lad. But this one time against Charlton, he took this touchdown right out there. <laughs> Tackles like this don't exist anymore. It would have been a straight red and I thought, oh, I can nick this. And Benny being quick at the time, not so quick no more. I've lunged. <laughs> I must have took him out knee high. And I was like, oh, no. And, and he stood up and went, Doss, what you done that for? I'm like, sorry there. I got, got there as quick as I could. You remember this, Daz? I do remember it. And I, I, I've always wanted to ask you why. I thought, I thought we were friends. We had a good relationship. Obviously, I tortured you in the <laughs> FA Youth Cup. I remember that. Game away about Forest, Ipswich Town, Portman Road. DB winner. I remember that. Yeah. Um, but why? I thought we got on well. We got England squads together. We had a laugh. We had a joke. Very well. But you never got a kick after I'd kicked you. So I actually did go for the ball, but you were too quick at that that time, Benny. I'll I'll give you that. But we beat you fair, fair and square that day, and you were you were very quiet after I'd kicked you. Did he ever kick you, does? I don't think he could catch me, to be honest. <laughs> I'd, have, I'd have missed him. But I generally, generally, Benny, it wasn't one of them where I went over the top. I was. I just, think you did. I didn't. I'm not gonna lie to you. After that game, I thought I can't believe Dawson's done that. Yeah, no. Nothing personal, mate. It was a uh, it was a great interview though with Sesk. Um, I mean, how did you get that gig? How did you get Sesk? Listen, that, it kind of just started on the pitch in terms of just talking. Why are you laughing? I'm just <laughs> I'm just wondering how you. The got story's it. weird, but obviously I, I've known for a long time. It was just one of them where we started talking on the pitch. That's how the kind of relationship. Did built. you did you always do well against Arsenal? You could say that one or two goals against <laughs> against Arsenal, um, and it just come from there. And then obviously I reached out to him and just said, "Oh, would you come on the boot room?" And he was. Like more than happy to come on, which was, which was good to, to get a player like Seth. Absolutely incredible. Um, as a, as a player playing against him, and then what what he's achieved, and then Bentley to get him on here shows the calibre that Bentley had. He had he had class in the, as a player, and and the hundred club that. Look, I played against Bentley. I'm not going to big him up too much, but he knew where the back of the net was. Appreciate it. Well, something I want to talk to you about after the break, and we'll do it. Was about Lasagna Gate. <laughs> we we got to talk about that. So, um, is your stomach recovered? Yes, <laughs> just about. It, it was uh, it was a hard day just because of oh, obviously the, the circumstances that were surrounding it. You may well laugh, and 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 it still hurts me here to to talk about it. it really does. Well, do you know what? Save that because we're going to talk about that after the break. This is Darren Bay's boot room on talk. 